was finishing my degree. We were state in criminal justice, and we were progressing along with um, all, the, all the medical care we could give my son, who um, my wife was carrying. So fast forward into September, um, because of the complications, I was turned down with my first job in Las Vegas because there's no way I could have trained during the time with those with um, the complications he was having. And so on September 11th, all this is going on throughout the year. It's just a memorable time in my life as um, things are progressing. On September 11th, I was also, I was working two jobs. I was on my way to uh, work my job in Salt Lake with my father-in-law at a machine shop. And I remember listening to the radio southbound on I-15 and breaking news comes across the, cha the, the radio station They're giving reports that a plane had flown into one of the Twin Towers and it was a passenger airline. All the information was so, so fresh at that time that they were reporting it as what appeared to be a tragic accident. So I pull up to the shop where in uh, Salt Lake where I worked and I go in and I'm talking to my father-in-law and I'm like, did you hear? He's like, yeah, he had it up on the news. And so we sat down watching the news station that was reporting on it. And then we watched as the second plane flew into the second tower on the news. And it's, we're saying that immediately that it was determined to be obviously delivered at that time. And it was just so crazy at that time everything was happening so fast. Um, so that happened on 9-11 on, so this is just a really traumatic time on September 14th, my wife went into labor with our son, which was uh, approximately two months early. And so he was born and on the 14th and passed away on the 15th due to complications. And so when you talk about 9-11, for some people it's a day, for me it was, a year of so many events in my life as you're trying to make plans and go on. And it's interesting to see you trying to start a career in law enforcement and you see all the things that impact you and define who you are as a person. And we're in Utah when all this is going on and all these events in our lives are defining us as people and who we're going to be. But yet none of us were there and were directly impacted by it. But emotionally, when our country is attacked, we are impacted. And so it's just really unique to see all of these defining events and how, for me, it's not a day. For me, it was a year, and I can talk to you about all the doctor's appointments. It was just a continuing event of con continuation of defining events in my life. And September 11th was just one part of those in 2001.